Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Susie from the blog Girl Gone Green, and today I'm going to be sharing all about my top sunscreen must haves for 2021. I'm sharing the products that I'm actually going to be using, the ones I love, my tried and trues for facial sunscreens and for my body. So let's dive in. Okay, if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe below, hit that big red button, and also hit the bell notification right next door. If you're wondering why it's so important to, to subscribe, it basically lets YouTube's algorithm know that you wanna see more information like this and more videos like this. It helps me reach more people um, when it comes to clean beauty and swapping their products out to safer products. So really is important in the long run. So if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe below. Also, if you haven't joined my Facebook group, be sure to join. I'm at Girl Gone Green Babes. There's over 2,700 of us just sharing all about natural living, natural beauty, our finds, our favorites, all the things. And if you haven't followed me yet on Instagram, be sure to follow me. I'm at Girl Gone Green, sharing my lifestyle over on IG. Okay, I thought it would be great to do just a video on what I will actually be using when it comes to a natural mineral sunscreen for my face and for my body um, throughout the summer. Summer is almost here. We're like a couple weeks away. And obviously when the sun's out or when summer hits, the sun's out and you know temperatures rise and we wanna make sure we're protecting our skin properly. I am all for making sure we're getting some vitamin D, um, but usually from 10 to two, they say is the height of the sun and you really can damage your skin if you're not protecting it. So you wanna make sure you are protecting it. And of course we wanna use a natural mineral sunscreen we don't want to use this chemical sunscreens if you're not familiar with why you should switch over to a mineral-based sunscreen versus a chemical sunscreen. I did a whole blog post on my blog all about um, why it's so important and just some studies and different things. So make sure and check that out. I'll leave a link below to that. I also have a post that I did all about EWG sunscreens that are approved by EWG. If you're not familiar with EWG, it's Environmental Working Group. It's basically a organization that really vets products and of all kinds um, and makes sure they're safe for you and your family. So I did a whole post on my top EWG safe sunscreens for 2021 too. So make sure and check that out as well. So let's dive in today. I just wanted to kind of give you exactly what I'll be using this summer um, when it comes to natural sunscreen. Again, natural sunscreen is anything using a mineral to block the sun versus a chemical. So a mineral meaning it's either zinc oxide or titanium dioxide. So I love using a couple different products and those are kind of my go-to. So I thought, why not share my routine when it comes to sunscreen for the summer? Okay, so the first product that I love, love when it comes to sunscreen is Beauty Counter's Sheer Defense. It's SPF 25, it's a broad spectrum sunscreen and it uses the mineral zinc oxide to help block the sun's rays. Um, what I love about this is it really, it's for your face specifically, but it really acts almost like a primer before you put on your makeup. So you don't need like another moisturizer on top of it. This is your moisturizer and your sunscreen in one. So easy, so simple. It feels so hydrating on the skin. It really helps to kind of fill in those fine lines and make everything smooth. So that way when you put on your, you know, makeup or whatever, it just seamlessly goes on, but then you also have that sun protection. So this came out not too long ago and I love it. It, it works so well. I think the big thing for me is a lot of times sunscreens can feel really greasy. You know what I'm talking about when they feel just, I don't know, like you have kind of that oily look to your skin. This really seeps in so well and just kind of fills in all those fine lines. So love this one. Um, definitely check it out if you haven't. Um, it's my favorite. So I'll put this on like every day, basically just as a moisturizer. And then I'll put makeup on if I'm just doing regular makeup. But then say if I'm going to go to the beach or if I'm going to just be out by the pool or something, I'll put this on and then I'll also maybe just put on like my tinted moisturizer as well. And they both do have SPF in them, but um, I put this on mainly just because it's hydrating and I know that it's getting all the areas where sometimes with my tinted moisturizer, I might not like be doing it all over my face. I'm just kind of doing my T-zone and rubbing out um, 
since it's a little, a really light kind of makeup look overall. So love this, wear it every day, my go-to. Okay, the next product is Beauty Counters Dew Skin. So this is their tinted moisturizer. It has SPF 20. So the one I just showed you, their Sheer Defense, has SPF 25. So it's a little bit higher. Um, really, really love this one. I used to actually not think I liked it. And then I used it um, again this past year. And I'm like, I love it. It's actually really, really lightweight, but it's really hydrating at the same time. It doesn't feel thick or heavy at all. If you do want more coverage, what I've done is I'll put this on and then I'll just go back through with a little bit of concealer. I love Beauty Counter Skin Twin Concealer. So what I'll do is I'll just go back through with the Skin Twin Concealer and touch up wherever I have a little redness, like in my T-zone or on my nose, underneath my eyes, and then it's perfect. Um, this is so great though, because in the summer, you don't really want that heavy makeup look or you don't want it to look cakey or you know, overall. So I love this because it just really looks seamless and sheer, but then you're also getting that SPF coverage. So if you do like to just kind of have everything in one, this is really great. So this is kind of my go-to if I'm just like wanting hydration, wanting a little bit of coverage, it just does all of it. Um, and then obviously it has the sunscreen. So this is another thing that I've been reaching for on those like pool days and the beach days when you want to look put together, but you don't want to do that much. This is perfect. Okay, the other product that I use nonstop is the Beauty Counter Counter Sun Tinted Mineral Sunscreen Spray. So this is SPF 30. Um, I love this product so much. If you follow me on IG, then you've heard me talk about it. Little disclaimer, sorry about the noise. They're doing some sort of construction, I guess, outside right when I started this video. So anyways, but I wanted to say I love this because it will literally give you a tint. It will, you know, make you go from white ghostly to like a bronze little goddess in a matter of a minute. Um, you don't have to wait at all. It's not like a self tanner where you have to put it on and then wait the, you know, six to eight hours. This instantly gives you a tan. So you just apply some on your hand, put it on all over, and it acts like a sunscreen while at the same time giving you that tint to your skin. Um, I can't tell you how many times I've used this just as my foundation because it instantly just covers redness, just covers so much and it makes you just look honestly healthier and better overall because who doesn't look better with a little healthy glow or a tan? So I love this when I'm just like, you know, I've used it a lot when I just go to my parents and I'm hanging out outside all day with the kids, um, but I want to just kind of feel put together. I'll put this on apply a little mascara and lip gloss and I'm like good to go. Um, it, like I said, it just makes you look fresh and put together. Um, this is great for the beach, the pool, anytime you are gonna be outside and you wanna protect your skin, but you do wanna look, you know, like you did something, this is so good. So I can't recommend this enough. If you even don't wanna bring any sort of foundation, just bring this and your concealer and you'll have basically your look because it really does conceal so much. And then for those like extra hard places, you can use your actual concealer. But I love this. And then I'll also spray it on like my body, like my shoulders or like my decollete where I often don't get as dark either because um, I might be wearing a t-shirt. And so it kind of blends everything and makes it look like, you know, it all flows. My arms are the same color as my shoulders and all that. So I love it for that. I will say that it can get on your clothes. I haven't found it to stain my clothes though. Um, it might get on them, but it's not It's not bad. I'm not wearing like white shorts with it. Like obviously you're gonna be able to tell, but usually I just have a tank top on and I'm like spraying this on my shoulders and it's fine and it comes off. And it's not like it's sticking everywhere, but I just wanted to throw that out there in case someone's like gonna wear white shorts and try this. Probably not a good idea. Just throwing it out there. Okay, the sunscreen that I use nonstop, my go-to favorite and budget-friendly. Yes, you heard it from me. It's budget-friendly. I've got your guys' back. Um, is the All Good Sunscreen. This is hands down just my favorite natural mineral sunscreen. It's really easy to find. They have it at a lot of just natural um, grocery stores, a lot of natural health food stores. Um, and it's really inexpensive. Like I feel like this is maybe, I don't know, like $12. At Pharmaca, you can even get it on sale, but it's not too crazy. Um, it has SPF of 30. It's like water resistant up to 80 minutes. 
it really does um, blend in really nicely too. You're not gonna get that like white hue like you would with a lot of mineral sunscreens. It's reef friendly and sweat resistant. So I use this on my kids. They have a kid's version. They also have spray versions if you're really into that too. Um, that work great, but this is what I would use on like all my body. Um, if I'm going out to the pool or the beach or I'm lathering this on my kids, it really does work just so well. And like I said, squeaky clean ingredients, ones that you can totally know and it's at a good price. So can't recommend this enough. Like literally just took this out of my purse to show you guys because that's how much I love it. I just keep it in my purse now because whether we're going to my parents and they're doing the slip and slide or, you know, I'm just out and about or whatever now, I feel like with the summer upon us, I know I need to have my sunscreen within reach. And so this is the one I constantly have on hand. It's, it's so good. Okay, the last product that I wanted to mention, but I actually cannot find it because it's in a box somewhere. We are moving next week and everything is kind of in disarray. So I couldn't find it, but um, I do really love this product and I wanted to mention it, especially if you do like a more full coverage foundation look, but also want the SPF for summer, this is it for you. It's the Elia Super Serum Skin Tint. They came out with it last year, I believe in the spring, and it definitely was one of those foundations I wore a lot during the summer when I wanted a little bit more full coverage. It has SPF 40, it's totally natural, mineral based, and it really does just cover everything it's it feels like a foundation it's a lot heavier not heavy in a bad way but just definitely has that more full coverage effect um it's a liquid and it works so well and it has the spf 40 which is a really high spf for a facial sunscreen a lot of those tinted moisturizers just don't have that much so if you're looking for something that really can kind of act as a true foundation in the summer and have that sunscreen the Elia Super Serum Skin Tint is your baby. You'll definitely love it. Um, definitely check it out. So anyways, I hope this video was so helpful when just thinking about like what sunscreen to get for the summer when it comes to your face and your body and for your family. These are really my go-tos and what I'll be using all summer. So I thought, why not share with you just my favorites and my go-tos um, that we love. So this is helpful. Make sure and give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below sharing more videos that you want to see. And I will see you next week. Have a good week, you guys.